Right, welcome to Sikapa Media Network TV channel. If today be the first time we you watch our videos, kindly hit the subscribe button, click on the notification bell to get notified anytime that we upload a video. Then you'll be the first person that you will get that video. Let's enjoy today's update. Circa 2007, I'm working at TV3 and there's a buzz of this young man who will spit bars with an unbelievable right, lyrical prowess. I mean, he raps in tree from beginning to end and he's able to take life's lessons and make them make sense to everybody. Adults, teenagers, uh, 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 young people, everyone is listening. So I've known Sack since the Duncan days, uh, Adom FM days when he used to freestyle. I was his he's biggest fan actually. And finally he came to the studio and history became legend. He looked too formal for me, for a rapper, but we gave him the chance. And after listening to him with the song Push, we're all excited we had discovered a genius. I've known Sakod here for over a decade, 15 years, I think. For a minute, in hip hop slang, that means a long time. I have known him for a minute. Sark is a disruptor. He doesn't stop until somebody has stopped and listened to what he's saying, till someone has benefited. And most likely, and in most cases, his message of, you know, be a better person, be financially literate, save money, um, build your empire, work hard, put in the time, put in the effort. A lot of those messages go out to the youth, to the grassroots, the people who are tomorrow's leaders. I've always believed that Sakodia would go very far. While we're trying to fix our sound and get on stage, as a DJ trying to get my set ready, this guy is still rapping. I always knew uh, Sak had the potential to go very far. Ochiame said something to me that I've never forgotten. Ochiame said, hey, me, there is a kid coming on the scene. If I don't move aside, this kid is going to cause problems for me. I've called him a wise person before because he thinks about his country. Absolutely, absolutely, there was no doubt in my mind. The very first day Sakodia dropped his first truck, you just knew that there was something really special about this particular gentleman. That's our golden boy. That's the, listen, that boy, that's all we got. I go to Gadi Azimia. I rap us her. What at all is he doing? The way he too much. And that's how you know Saka is also cool. And the Tikobi. <laughs> and so, yeah. But it was a chummy Kwame that drew my attention to him and said, Oh, dear be pay attention to him. Surviving about three eras in hip hop, hip life, surviving the old, old school, the old school, the mid school, and the new school, and still being number one, is, um, it makes him a gem. When you see him, he's the struggle of hip, hip life. Sakodie embodies everything that we fought for since the early 90s, you know, to be listened, to be heard. The authenticity, the originality, the uniqueness of the voice, of the rap, and the way the words flow of his tongue. Just beautiful. Sakodie is, he's an amazing story. The whole country, almost everybody sat back and watched the man grow, like from Akola, which means the Papani Yini, the bank account Yini. Or yet ten ten, or yet cashier, I won't fail them. Be pia. A sack's biggest fun. One word will not be enough to describe San Kodier. They had the radio on now, and I heard this rap. Listen, I paused. Let me. I said, who is that? The dude just he just stood out. To say. Sack should be studied in institutions, it's not far-fetched. He deserves more than one word. He's phenomenal, he's resilient, he's, he's amazing. If we are celebrating Rapaholic at 10, I just want to say congrats to Sack. I mean, I remember Adonai, and I remember where I was personally, and I remember what it meant to just say, I need to just stand up and sing praises, and it was, you know, this song that took me through some of my darkest times. You have come this far through great passion, commitment, dedication, and minding your business. I am so, so proud of you. A great human being. The Kasi Nyansa, Nyansa, wisdom. That boy moved different. 
I was there from the very first one and looking back in terms of his craft and how he pulls each rapaholic off each year has been exciting. This guy right here, there's only one word for him, rapaholic. If Christmas Day reminds us of anything, it's rapaholic. Whether they, they like Sarkozy or they don't like Sarkozy, they've had his influence for the past 10 of years Music and over. And, and I believe he should keep doing that. Sark, keep doing what you are doing. You are one of the other flags of Ghana. Anytime we see you, we see Ghana. I love you with all of my heart. You are a king, you are a gem. Congratulations. If you are not yet, if you are not yet, that's what I Did I know he was going to be a star? Yes. So Sark, I do celebrate you. It's been 10 years. And on this moment, or at this moment, I dare say you are just about to blow. Um, when we say global, it is synonymous with King Sark. Welcome to Rapaholic Chapter X.